Hey. Hi. You know something weird? I was murdered this weekend. My neighbor came into my apartment with a gun and shot me three times at close range, right in the chest. Like, like right here, you know? He was chuckling to himself the whole time. He walked into my apartment with a gun, intending to kill another human being, and then he did it. I mean, he did it. He pulled the trigger three times, three times, one, Two, three, he did it. I thought maybe he was just saying hello, but nope. He was there for murder. 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 I mean, I lived under a murderer and he murdered me. It didn't work, obviously. Great food, huh? Uh, yeah. Pamplemousse. J'adore le pamplemousse. <laughs> I used to say that in high school French class. I know. Duh. How would you know? Well, I remember. I was there. Hey, not trying to call you out or anything, but I think I would remember if there was a whatever it is you are stuck to me in high school. Pretty sure I would have been mocked for that. I'm you. Well, I was in fact mocked for being me. You were murdered, but you're still here. I'm the you that was murdered. I'm your wound. So. Yeah. Hey, Amy, what's up? Oh, hey, nothing much. Finally saw Endgame, got murdered. Oh, what'd you think of Fat Thor? I was like, uh, can we get Hot Hemsworth back? I, I was murdered, Darlene. Look, I have a wound. Uh, are you okay, Amy? Uh, what are you talking about? My neighbor came into my apartment and pointed a gun at me and shot me three times. At first, I thought he had brought me a present, but he was laughing. And then I thought, wait. We don't have that kind of relationship. And then I couldn't move, and it wasn't a present. It was a gun, and he murdered me. Oh, wow. Uh, that's terrible. Glad you're okay, though. Um, we really need to do something about how many guns are out there on the street. Okay. Oh, uh, did you get a chance to submit that transcript yet? Marshall needs it by Friday. Anyway, uh, virtual hugs. <laughs> Glad you're okay. Phew. We've had multiple uh, school shootings across the country. I believe nine of those incidents involved a case where somebody was injured or killed. So this would be something like the 18th incident in which a gun apparently was used at a school so far this year. And again, up until now, nine of those has, have involved injuries or deaths. This is still very much uh, an active scene, an ongoing scene in uh, the greater Miami metro area with a very heavy police response, fire and EMS and medical response as well, and the FBI is also in route. But as you mentioned, Kristen, this is at this moment uh, a very much a local operation. <laughs> said we had to go to Fresno for the depot and I just I rolled my eyes. Ugh, Fresno, that place is a toilet.
Teresa's face is a toilet. <laughs> Jules a dick. How do you work with him all the time, Amy? Well, I mean, it's not hard. Not after you've been murdered. Are you still talking about that? Yes, Teresa. What should I talk about instead, Teresa? Isn't it a chilly day outside, Teresa? Blah, blah, Marshall sucks, blah, blah, Teresa. Fuck off. Whoa, whoa, I hadn't heard this. What happened? Oh, some guy broke into her apartment and tried to shoot her. Who cares? Excuse me. He did not just try to shoot me. He shot me. He came into my apartment with a gun with the full intention of murdering a human. Me. Me, a human being, that he was going to shoot until I was dead. He pointed a gun at me and pulled the trigger three times. At first, I thought maybe it was a trick, like a present, like a lighter shaped like a gun for some reason. And he was smiling and he was laughing. And so I smiled and laughed, even though the voice in the back of my head was saying, no, wait, this is wrong. You don't have that kind of relationship. Drama much? You asked what happened, asshole. He didn't ask for your whole fucking life story. Then what did he ask for, Teresa? Then what did he ask for, Teresa? Look, people don't want to hear your bullshit, okay? Nobody cares what you have to say. You can't change anything. People are going to get shot. Guns are here to stay. And you know why? It's in the fucking Constitution. Second Amendment, baby. Read it and weep. The Second Amendment cannot be defeated. Guns protect me and my family from tyranny, oppression, and other guns. Because you know what stops a bad guy with a gun? A good guy with a gun. So don't come in here with your green heart, liberal bullshit, and try to get good law-abiding citizens to give up their God-given right to a gun, okay? Because these colors do not bleed. Does anyone have a copy of the updates to the Southern Brief? <laughs>